Oh, this Tina, how y'all doing? Today is Thanksgiving Eve. Now, I'm going to come back later on with another video. Let me tell y'all what I did. Remember I bought that 99J hair, and I was going to mix it with the 1B, put the 1B at the bottom. Got halfway through the wig and was like, I don't feel like finishing it. That's just how I felt. So, actually, because the cold front was coming through for my birthday, I ended up wearing my big wild hair to work that morning and that evening, and it's been cold and icky all week. So I had put my other hair on. A half wig. I had made that was a little exact, because y'all know I got a big old head and I got a lot of hair on it. So with this big head and this big hair, I um, made that wig exact. So it was a little snug, but it was some um, old deep wave hair. So I said, I really like how that half wig came out. Maybe if I make an old, a full wig, it'll look like the Solange hair. Well, that's what it looked like. It's a combination between the Solange and Tiana Taylor look. So that's what I was going for. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take that... Um, I'm going to take a picture of that later on um, when I get up. I was just laying here. I said, let me give them an idea of what I do, what I'm doing, because I got to cook, like, cook. I mean, my kids are big. Like I tell people all the time, I have two teenage boys. Well, I actually have three teenagers. My daughter, she's 19. But I have three teenagers, and my oldest son, he's coming home from school. Uh, his lady friends coming with him. Uh, then, you know, I have, you know how you have people drop by. So, and then I'm cooking something for my niece who just had a baby. Her baby is gorgeous. Oh my God, I saw him up close and personal. I always see him on pictures because I don't like bothering people, people when they first have their babies. And he's like three weeks old. So they were in, um, I was dropping something off for him because I had a Thanksgiving basket for her. Um, so I gave it to her and she was like, oh my God, thank you, Auntie. I didn't even expect that. That's something I don't have to buy. I said, well, just to make your Thanksgiving a little bit easier. So anywho, um, that's about it. Uh, stop by, take care of some stuff. Well, today what I'm going to do is... Um, stuff my peppers, prep my peppers, stuff those, boil my macaroni for my macaroni and cheese, uh, prep all my meat for my gumbo, and no, I'm not. Yes, I am. I'm going to cut up the small pieces uh, for my gumbo. Uh, what else? That's about it and fix my pies because my desserts I like to have them out the way and I'll run them through the oven run everything through the oven uh, later on the night so first thing in the morning I could throw the gumbo on throw the ham in the oven and we'll be eating by 10 o'clock like always anyway um, and run the macaroni and cheese in there because I, my husband's like no don't make two pans of macaroni and cheese I said do you realize we have the goblins over here and they always bring their friends, and we always end up with two people out the neighborhood and some friends from down the street and pooking them and uh, all their little cousins and all them that come out the woodwork like roaches. And I said, I don't feel like coming, uh, getting up Friday morning talking about, oh, I got to cook again. Because what I really want is some of that, that leftover ham for my grits and eggs and b biscuits the next morning. That's what I really want. Oh, I love that next day when you have, well, normally it'll happen around Christmas. But because we had turkey parts a couple of weeks ago, my kids were like, we don't want turkey that close. So they want a ham. Well, anywho, I said, excuse me, I say Thanksgiving ain't Thanksgiving without turkey. So I'm going to have some form of turkey. I'm going to do me a small turkey breast, but they don't know it just yet. Well, anywho, guys, um, I'm going to come back and show you that later. Because yesterday, I thought I was cute. I had taken my hair loose because I didn't feel like, um, I always keep my hair twisted up underneath my wigs. So I had taken my hair loose and let it go free. Did my makeup, had my lashes on. I thought I was cute. And uh, the young lady in Nordstrom Rank was like, gosh, um, 
you're extra glamorous because she knows me. She said, you're extra glamorous today. I said, I feel extra glamorous today, which I did. So anyway, um, guys, y'all have a good one. It's cold outside. Stay warm. Um, if it's warm outside where you are, stay cool. Anyway, have a great evening, and I'll come back probably later on to show you my big, my big old hair. Because I had been looking on YouTube, and I was like, that's the la that's the hairstyle that I wanted. It was a young lady that did it just like that. And I said, that's the hairstyle I was looking for. And you know me, I always have some extra hair left over. And I went and picked up another pack of this. Oh, I made it do what it do. And it came out really, really cute. So I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.